Thank you. The Union Gospel Mission held their annual barbecue fundraiser today. And this marks 10 years of their work as Dallas Payton reports. While anyone in the community can come out and get a free meal, the donations that are made from the meal stretch much farther than you can see. John Rector, the executive director for the Union Gospel Mission, says the donations benefits their cause in the community. We offer a couple of different residential programs for men struggling with uh, life controlling issues. Some of them are drugs or alcohol or some other thing that's got them bound. And, and so we work to help them get their lives back together. We also do a ton of community outreach. We serve uh, dinner downtown to the homeless on the holidays, Thanksgiving, Christmas, Easter. Union Gospel also goes to homeless camps and takes food and cold drinks during the summer months. Today, many people came out to get a free meal and donate to show their support. Obviously, it's good to have people donate and money to come in, but the most important thing is that they're just involved in helping us with our cause, now, helping us impact lives. Uh, again, those folks who may not be reached any other way by what we do. And there's other great organizations that, you know, that work and do that thing, and that's great. We, we partner with them where we can, but this is kind of where God's called us and put us, and we want to do our part to help. Ron Dyer is one of those supporters. He comes out every year, no matter the location. Dyer says it feels good knowing his dollars are going towards a good cause. It makes you feel good. Uh, you know, there's a lot of people that need help, especially nowadays. and. And uh, what he's doing is just helping uh, people change their lives. And it's, uh, uh, you know, you can't, uh, there's no money to, dollar amount to put on that. Union Gospel received a $5,000 matching gift for the fundraiser. If you would like to donate to the cause, you can do so under this story on our app. For Local 3 News, I'm Dallas Payton.